Nice one, guys. So basically, I'm in the kitchen right now with another one. And I'm going to show you exactly how to make this and an amazing drink right here. I got some sari, some ginger, some lemon, and some cloves. Okay? Yeah. I'm going to show you. Well, it's Christmas, guys. Okay? It's Christmas. And we are trying our best to give you some recipe where you guys can use at home in your kitchen. Okay? Now... The thing is, where a lot of people doesn't know that sorrel have a lot of health benefit, okay? Now, if you are a member, welcome to my YouTube channel and thank you so much to join my membership and for your support and for your time. It is Christmas. Sorrel is a number one drink where a lot of people use in Christmas. But tonight, we're not going to make in a sorrel drink we're gonna make a sorrel tea because a lot of people doesn't know that sorrel have a lot of health benefit here it is sorrel this one 100 percent natural and this is a dry one i've been using okay guys you can go on google and type in the benefit of sorrel right so it is christmas and a lot of people is going all over the whole place looking for sorrel doing all sort of stuff with sorrel but i'm gonna tell you something where a lot of people doesn't know if you ever drink sorrel for at least five to six days straight you will see the changes in your life and a big difference trust me and i guarantee you 100 i'm gonna make a beautiful sorrel drink tonight for a tea or you can drink this before you go to your bed are in the morning and a empty stomach okay guys and i know you guys will love this cup of tea what i'm gonna make you tonight it is late in this time at the moment but normally i try to do my show at two o'clock and one o'clock during the night okay if you are not a member of my youtube channel you need to join the membership and support thank you so much let's do the, our lovely tea now Big up my Facebook audience who support Chef Ricardo. All right. They know that Chef Ricardo always tune in one o'clock, two o'clock in the morning. And not only that, a lot of people is looking for this. I have people has said to me, Chef Ricardo, this guy said to me, Chef Ricardo, I'm always sitting up waiting for you to do your show. Every night the man said to me, sit up. This man is like a hundred and three year old and he's watching my YouTube channel. Okay. Right. now We have 100 people watching. All right, 102, 101. Okay, let's get my like up to 100 like tonight. All right? Yeah. Okay. So tonight, I'm only going to make one cup of tea tonight. That's all I'm going to make tonight. One cup of tea for you guys tonight to show you what I can do with sorry. Okay? So first of all, to be honest with you, I'm going to um, get my cooker on. Okay. So wherever you are watching, I want to take the time to say thank you so much for watching my YouTube channel. And I appreciate it. Okay. I want to get, before I start my show, I want my like to go up to at least 50. And then I will start the show. Because a lot of people need to see this video. What I'm going to make right now. Okay. Because... This video is a very important video for someone tonight where a lot of people doesn't even know that Saril also have health benefit of help to reducing high blood pressure. Okay, guys, and a lot more stuff help to detox the body and also. Okay, so we're going 39. So let's get my like up to 40, 50, 50 like the least. Mr. Boo, thank you so much for coming on the show. I really appreciate it, man. Sorry, are you going to be making sorry for Christmas? Let me know if you're going to make sorry for Christmas, guys. Who going to make sorry for Christmas? Join the membership and, so, and, and Super Chat Chef Ricardo right away. If you're going to make sorry for this Christmas. Christmas is a time where everyone try to make sorry drink. And sorry is a very... In Thank you so much. 50! Thank you so much, guys. I really appreciate it. All right, we got 50 like. That's good. 52. Oh, that's good. Okay? Now, let's start the show for my beautiful people. Trust me, it is late in the morning. 
in London. But the thing is, I was sleeping and I know I have to do my show this time of the night. Yes, I'm always making, but this time is going a little bit. Ah, oh, okay. All right. Okay. Okay. Okay, Michibu. Um, <laughs> bless you. Bless you. Thank you so much, Dua. I really appreciate your coming on the show. Big up, Tony. Yeah, Tony, good morning. <laughs> All right. Um, I don't know if Dolce going to join this morning. Uh, Michibu, do you know that was Dolce birthday this month? You know? Just like you. All right. Now, we got 100. Let's get to get 150 people to watch the video. And then we're going to start the show. You might have said, Chef Ricardo, why are you dragging out this thing? I just don't be talking. <laughs> a lot of people say, Chef Ricardo, Chef, I am going to give you a nice. Oh, thank you so much. All right. No worries. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, and this, thank you so much for coming on the show. Really appreciate it 100%. Thank you so much. Now, what I want to simply say to you, big up all of my members who support Chef Ricardo. Okay, if you're a member, thank you so much for the support. All right. Now, what I want to say to you guys, Saril. <laughs> oh my God. Saril, 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 Saril. Guys, I don't understand. There is something special about Saril. And can someone share that with me? Can someone share the Saril recipe with me? Just a second, guys. I come in. Just one second. I come in. I come in. Just get this fixed right now because this need to fix. Okay. All right. I need to fix this right now. Just one second. Just a second. Just a second. Just a second. All right. I need to fix this thing right here. All right. I'm ready again. Alida, thank you so much. Members of my YouTube channel, I just see you popped up in the screen. Alida, thank you so much for coming on the show. I really appreciate it. All right? All right. Yes. Now, anyone have any ideas about Saril? Please let me know in the description box of the video. Okay? One. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Thank you so much. Guys, let's get my YouTube channel share this video because this video is supposed to share. A lot of people need to know what's going on with Saril. Saril is a very important drink and a lot of people make it time of the year. All right? Yeah. A lot of people like it. Yeah, you're welcome. Thank you so much. All right. Um, here it is. So when, when, when I was growing up, and I mean, I used to do the Jamaican. This one is... <laughs> It's 63%, very strong. All right. Some Jamaican white rum. But we're not going to make the sorrel drink tonight. We want to make a tea from the sorrel tonight. Now, when I'm going to make the sorrel, I'm going to do the sorrel another night for you to show you how to jar the Jamaican sorrel and how to sweeten it and how to put the Jamaican rum in it. So basically, you need to get some rum. All right. And some red label wine. All right, red label wine. So this is very good. All right, and this is where you're going to, and I'm going to do a video to show you guys how to soak your fruits if you are late to soak your fruits for Christmas. But this year, we want to do a different kind of fruit cake this year from every other else here. All right. Up, up. <laughs> all right. No, this is all good Jamaican white rum. All right, this is a 35 this is no 63%, not too strong. This is a good Jamaican white rum, guys. Look at this. All right. Now, tonight is not the sorrel drink we're going to make. We're going to make a tea from the sorrel. Okay? So what you want to do, grab yourself a medium-sized pot like this. Okay? And then what you're going to do, you're going to grab at least two cups of water because the sorrel is very strong. Lovely. Turn on my cooker. All right, the cooker is on. All right, let's get this to um at least 185. At least 100 like, guys. We got 85 likes already. Thank you so much. Now. All right. 
right. I want you to go to, I don't know if you guys can get the dry one because I only can get the dry one. See there? 100% natural sorrel. Go and get the dry sorrel at your supermarket or your local shop, wherever you are. If you're in Jamaica, you may get the fresh one, which is even much better. Okay? If you are in London or in the state, you may get the dry one. Sometimes you can get the fresh one. But I will recommend it, you. See if you can get the dry one. The dry one is very strong and good. All right, so what you want to do, roughly about two cups of water or one and a half cups of water into the pot like this. And what you're going to do, you're going to put, I've got roughly about quarter cups of dry sorrel. This is my tips to you guys. Please wash off the sorrel before you use it. Please wash off the sorrel before you use it. Do not take it from the bag and put it straight into the pot. Red flag. All right. All right. Thank you so much, Michibu. Thank you so much for that. A quick research already. Thank you so much. How does I do some research for me? All right. Now, do not take the sorrel from the bag and put it into the pot. Wash off your sorrel first because it can have dirt. You can have a lot of stuff on it. Okay? You need to wash it first. All right, guys? So what you want to do, you want to get at least quarter cups of the sorrel right here. And I'm already washed off mine. All right? I wash off mine. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to put this quarter cup into the pot like this. All right? Now, with the dry sorrel, I don't want to rush it and make it over boil. And, you know, I want to take time with it and dry it. Okay. Now, with the sorrel, a lot of people doesn't know that sorrel have so much health benefit. All right. Yeah, yeah. You have to wash it first, Santi. You have to. You have to wash the sorrel first. Now, the the dry sorrel is so strong at it right now. It's very very strong. Okay, very strong. All right. Now. The whole secret behind this sorrel drink tonight, okay? The whole secret behind the sorrel drink, I'm going to share with you why it's so important for you to do this one. Now, also, we're going to get a piece of a cinnamon stick. Guys, I'm going to tell you this. A lot of people doesn't know these things, you know. We're going to get a piece of a cinnamon stick and we're going to put it into the water like this also. All right? Now, what we're going to do, we're going to get some cloves. All right, this is the cloves which I'm going to be using. You don't need to use the amount of cloves when we're using because cloves is very strong. Okay, but this is the amount I'm using in mine at the moment. Okay, so if you want to use few, you can use few. It all depends the amount of cloves where you would like to use. So I'm going to be using roughly about half teaspoon of cloves right here inside of it. Okay. And I'm going to put the cloves into it just like this. I'm going to give it a mix. All right. So as I say, I'm not join. I'm not make like join Christmas sorry now. I'm just making a cup of tea from sorry for you to show you what you can drink before you go to your bed this Christmas. Sorry is not only just for Christmas, guys. It also you can drink it right straight through the year. And you have a lot of health benefit behind it. If you have some time, please go and Google and type in the benefit of sorrel. Okay? So basically, as you notice, I had cinnamon stick, cloves into it. All right? Then what we're going to do, we're going to add some ginger to it. So we're going to get a piece of a ginger and add to it. All right? So what we're going to do, we're going to grate a piece of a ginger into it like this. Please join the YouTube channel membership and support Chef Ricardo. Okay, guys, or go over to my Instagram, Chef Ricardo Cooking, and follow me. Go over to my website, chefricardo.co.uk, and also you can get CMOS 
in this time and days, you need CMOS in your life, okay? So if you go on my website right now, you can click on one of those CMOS link and you can buy your CMOS. There's a percentage off at the moment, all right? So you want to grate a piece of ginger like this. All right, nice, lovely chunk of piece of ginger. That is a lovely chunk of piece of a ginger right there. All right. Now, we just need this to get to the boil. All right, we're just gonna boil it up a little bit. So you, you cannot rush it. You have to take your time and draw the sorry and then it come to a boil. All right? Do not rush it. All right? Do not rush the sorry. Do not, like, you turn up a high temperature on it. Like, you're going to cook it like you cook beef or chicken. No. You take your time and have it on a medium-sized eat and a slow eat. And you take time until you see it. You just come to a boil. All right, then strain it and drink it. Now, the thing with the sorrel right here, which I'm sharing with you tonight, and I'm going to say something to someone tonight. You may not know. This is just so much health benefit in this. Very good for your ear. Very good for the skin. Full of fiber. It's just so much into it. So it's not only just Christmas. You can say to yourself, okay, Christmas is coming. I'm going to have to drink some sorrel. No. If you can, once you can get the chance of holding sorry, drink it right straight through the year. No problem. When I'm a young man was growing up <laughs> in Jamaica, sorry only come once a year. It's only Christmas. My grandmother used to plant sorry, and I would, I'm just picturing it right now. She's just walking up to the hill and cutting that sorry and going to bring it down to make sorry for Christmas. My grandmother didn't know this right now, that if you drink sorry right straight through, have such a health benefit it can help to heal your body very good for the skin make your skin look nice and lovely good for the year um, full of fiber there's a lot very good for digesting there's so much into the into the sorrel and the very important thing of the sorrel you got cloves inside of it which makes the difference so guys this is an, an amazing and fantastic drink for you guys to do at home now i will Coming with part two when I'm going to be doing Christmas sorrel. All right, so Christmas sorrel is going to be totally different. So I'm going to show you how to make your Christmas sorrel and put it down into a buckle and get it ready for Christmas for your family to sit down and sit down around the table and have a beautiful Christmas dinner. All right, but as you can see, I'm taking my one little time with the sorrel. You cannot rush it. All right. Sorry, is not something where you rush. You take time and enjoy it. And then it just come to a boil and then you are good to go. Put a little bit more heat on it, Chef Ricardo. So I just put a little bit more heat. But remember, one thing, guys. Do not take the sorrel from the bag and put it into the water. Wash it first. Wash it with some cold water. If you have uh, some... Then that you got like some fruits wash or something like that, you can... But I only do that. Just wash it with some water and make sure it, if any dirt or anything inside of it, make sure you check it very, very carefully because things can be into the bag which you do not see and you put it into the pot and you drink it. Okay? Beautiful. But look at that. Rich and nice. And this is what you want to drink this Christmas. And not only that, I'm going to give you one more tips where you can also do with this. can do these are some peppers all right all a green pepper let's chop a few inside of it to get a little spice from the pepper mix with the ginger so basically that's going to activate inside of your system inside of your body working with the ginger and the cloves uh, we all know that cloves have a lot of health benefit then the cinnamon stick wow guys I'm going to say something to you. Someone messaged me. I said to my chef, Ricardo, you need to stop giving this free, free recipe. But I'm saying to the person, it's not a free recipe. 
It's not free. It's not free, to be honest with you. It is a blessing to know we can do something like this, and it's also good for our health. And I'm happy. All right? Yeah.